BTM 13's Chip Scarborough on how federal authorities will keep the suspects behind bars for some time. A handful of stolen guns recovered during an eight month drug trafficking investigation centered in Tuscaloosa County. In all, 10 people arrested and charged in connection with the armed drug trafficking ring that authorities say spanned several states. Each suspect has an average of seven prior arrests. That's an amazing amount of time and effort and money, uh, time and effort by law enforcement here in Tuscaloosa and, and arresting and rearresting these people. Investigators say they found methamphetamine, cocaine and synthetic marijuana, among other drugs. They say the investigation started as part of an effort to lower violent crime in the area. The Authorities say the use of weapons to further drug trafficking only makes happen. matters worse. Drugs kill people. Criminals with guns kill people. Drug users steal and rob to get the money for their drugs. I mean, every aspect of this is horrible for the community. Local law enforcement sought the help of federal authorities so the people involved would not be eligible for parole and would not end up right back on the streets. If they get a five year sentence within reason. They're going to do almost five years of that time. And that means that citizen out there that was being victimized will not see them back out on the street next year. Investigators say more arrests are likely. In Tuscaloosa, Chip Scarborough, WVTM 13.